Nice. You. you fitting you for it? I was just dropping you off some food and some food. Oh my gosh. I don't have my camera. Telling me you love me, but I don't see it. I'm so in love with you. Don't leave begging you, please, please. Telling me you love me, but I don't see it. YouTube! YouTube, what's going on with y'all, gang? You know what it is, man. It's Troy Alexis. I'm actually coming to y'all. I got uh some camera footage for y'all. Whoa. What is this? Uh, iPhone footage for y'all today. I'm about to go get a... Uh, she don't know yet, but I'm about to go buy her something from the store. Something simple. It's not, it's not the holiday yet, but the holiday coming up. You know what I'm saying? So you got to do things for your lady, man. You know what I'm saying? You got to make sure she stay happy. So I'm surprised her with some flowers today. And I might get a some lunch or whatever the case may be. I'm in Inglewood, California right now, and I'm about to be on my way to, uh, where I'm going? To Beverly Hills, Rodeo Drive, or around that area or whatever. So y'all stay tuned, man. I'm gonna show y'all. Y'all let me know what I should get for it. You know what I'm saying? It's just something simple. It's an everyday type of thing. You know what I mean? So let me know, y'all. I'm gonna get with y'all in a minute, all right? Gang. All right, y'all, so. I'ma see, I'm in a uh, Ralph's grocery store. They got in Inglewood, California. We're all through California. And uh let me see if y'all can see what roses are good. I don't know. They got a lot of I don't know, I feel like I feel like the regular red roses is like very normal. You know what I'm saying? Kinda gotta do it. Let's do the pink ones. I think she likes purple. We're gonna get some of these. Oh shit. Shit, I done spilled water on myself, y'all. God damn. Yeah. But I think these are better than uh the red roses. Cause it's like, you know, a little different. Are these roses? I don't know. These blossoms, I don't know what kind of flowers these actually are, but we're gonna get them to see. Alright. In the minute. She also likes salad, so we're gonna get her a. Uh, she wants Cobb salad. Oh, they got Cobb salad to stop. Cobb salad for lunch. Great salad. Yeah, but I mean like good part. You know? We got a Cobb salad, and we got some flowers. We're gonna see if she likes it. I think she might got a salad already for lunch, but you can never eat too much. Definitely women, you know? Gotta feed you later. All right, so that's what we got so far, y'all. Talk to y'all in a minute. All right, y'all, so what I got was, I got these flowers right here. I don't know, I think they some nice flowers. Whatever the case may be. Don't mind my hair, I know it look a mess, but that's cool. So I got her those flowers, they cost a lot. Not too much, probably like uh, a couple dollars. I got her a salad, she likes salad, so I got her a cob salad. She loves the Cobb salads, right? So I got her one of these. And I got her a uh, Red Bull. You know, I don't know why she like Red Bull like that, but she loves Red Bull. And I got a roasted turkey, or not turkey, a roasted chicken. Yeah. She gonna be like, what the hell is this? It's lunch, so eat it. Shut up, right? So I'm, on my, I'm in Inglewood. I'm on my way. I'm about to leave from Inglewood. And uh, I'm gonna show y'all pretty much like i guess i don't know if you consider it is downtown uh beverly hills but literally right rodeo drive if y'all ever heard of that she lit she works literally like on the next street over you heard me so we'll be there in a minute probably take like 20 minutes to get there i'm gonna holla at y'all in a minute all right okay so look another thing i'm gonna tell y'all check this out la traffic ain't shh. it's not that bad right now but after 2 30 3 o'clock traffic is gonna be ridiculous look at that on the other side yeah it's getting there and this is only it's only like 2 12 2 20 at this right now you know but la traffic is terrible it's like one of the worst states to be as far as driving but y'all don't care about that what y'all care about is with the situation at hand i'm about to surprise my girl with some flowers and some good food hopefully she like it so Y'all see me in a minute once I touch down in Beverly Hills. 
or whatever. I don't really go to Beverly Hills like that unless I drop her off if I use her car or she take my truck or whatever the case may be. That's the only time I really go to Beverly Hills, but I really don't go to Beverly Hills like that. You know what I'm saying? Unless it got to do with her. Only because I'm not rich yet and I can't live in Beverly Hills, so I don't want to be around. Okay. We are pretty much in Beverly Hills. We're not on Rodeo yet, but it's beautiful out here. I love it out here. Very peaceful, quiet. There's not a lot of people, you know what I mean, that look like me out here, but it's a beautiful city. And one day I'll live out here. I live like 15 minutes away, but where I live at is completely different neighborhood than what this is. But nonetheless, it's all about what you make it, man. If you want to be here, you can be here. Nobody and nothing can ever, no one could ever tell you that you're not able to be in Beverly Hills or Calabasas or the Hidden Hills or Hollywood or whatever the case may be. You know what I mean? Beverly Hills Plaza right there. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's all up to you what you want to do. You just have to make it work yourself. That's all. But... I'm going to get back to y'all in a minute once I touch down. <laughs> I literally live 15 minutes away from here, but it's not as beautiful. It's beautiful. Inglewood is a beautiful city as well. They call it the Black Beverly Hills. You know what I mean? I love it out there. Like, I'm from the projects. I love the hood. But California hoods are better than our hoods where I come from, in my personal opinion or whatever. But I'll tell y'all this. If I get the chance to live out here... <laughs> Then I'm gonna live out here You hear me? So I can't do that because I'm broke So y'all gotta like and subscribe And get me lit YouTube Get me lit So I can give back to y'all too On gang So we just passed the Beverly Hills Hilton Hotel Where Whitney Houston The uh, the late great Whitney Houston Rest in peace her soul Passed in that hotel Literally right behind us Or whatever the case may be On what street is this? This is, hell, I don't know, shit. Whatever street we on, but we in Beverly Hills and at the Hilton Hotel behind us, it's where Beverly Hills passed that actually in the tub. It was actually back there, you know what I mean? And uh, we'll be by Rodeo very soon. So I'm gonna let y'all know when we get there. Beautiful city, man. Well, beautiful part of the city. And it's crazy because I literally only live Hold on, let me see. I literally. All right, y'all. So we just pulled. I just pulled up to Brighton Way, which is a street over from Rodeo. I'm gonna make sure I ride past so y'all can see that too. But uh, I'm about to drop her off her food and uh, her flowers, just to let her know that I care. You know, sometimes you gotta do things because you gotta let your spouse or your other significant other know that you care, right? And that's what this is about today. So, I paid for it with her car, but don't tell nobody that. <laughs> but, nonetheless, it's too rich over here. I kind of feel uncomfortable a little bit because uh, I'm not from out here. And there's a lot of other people that, that is out here or whatever. I mean, I got a nice car, a decent car or whatever. So, I kind of blend in a little bit. But, let's see if she likes this, y'all. Give me one minute. Oh yeah, by the way, she works at Claudia. She's the not the owner, but she runs the store. Claudia by Joanna Hernandez. She's very, 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 she's a very great person. They sell wedding dresses in here. I'm about to show y'all in a minute exactly what they do or whatever, but she sells wedding dresses and, and suits for men and women that get married and things like that. So, I'll show y'all in a minute. Oh, okay. they beat the light. Nice shop too. See? I gotta be quiet. Hello, hello, hello. How you guys doing? How you doing? How you? Beautiful dress. Thank you. Thanks for her pageant. It's for a pageant? Can I? Can I? Okay, okay. You got a pageant? Where you? What, what kind of pageant is it? Miss Global Citizen. Miss Global Citizen? Yeah. Oh, wow. It looked nice. Thank you. She fitting you for it? I was just dropping you off some food. And some food. Some flowers. Oh, my gosh. 
I don't have my camera camera, but I got this for you. Uh, oh, I got something else in there. Let me know. Look, come look at it real quick. Can I borrow her for like 20 seconds? Okay. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Between this and yeah, oh, I help y'all out. Don't worry about it. I'll tell, oh, you, I'll tell you. Yeah, I got you the cob salad. I don't because I, I bought two, right? I cannot. Did you, you already have one? Yeah. Did you bring one? Did you eat it already? No. Okay, you got, so you got two. And boom. What's that? Uh, wings? No. It's a little tissue with chicken. Are you trying to get me fat? A little bit. And then I got you the juice you like. <laughs> and then look, I got you this. You know why? Because I love you. <laughs> I love you too. Give me a kiss. I'll give you one. Mm, yeah. All right, y'all. So that was a success. Uh, she she liked the uh, what was it? The lunch that I gave her and the flowers. She was just busy with a customer. Uh, if anybody is ever looking to get married, rather you're younger, older, or old enough to get married, of course. Come to Beverly Hills on Brighton Way in Beverly Hills to uh, Joanna, uh, Claudia uh, by Joanna Hernandez or whatever. She got the best dresses. She got the best soups and everything else. Trust me, y'all will not be fucking disappointed. I swear to you. Beautiful dresses. So, But what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to somehow turn around from where I'm at um, and make a U-turn so I can show y'all Rodeo Drive before... I end this video because I don't want it to be too long. I just wanted to give y'all a quick little, you know what I'm saying? From Inglewood to Beverly Hills. And if y'all want to know more about Inglewood, I can show y'all the best spots in Inglewood where I go to every day. Uh, the best spots in Beverly Hills where I'm at every other day. You heard me? And all of that. So, you know, y'all just let me know if y'all like the content, like the videos, and let me know what y'all want to see. I can show y'all anything. Anything y'all look up in California that y'all want to see, and y'all think other people may want to see, I can show you everything you want to see out here because I'm out here and I live here and I ain't got nothing but time on my damn hands to do it, right? So I'll do that for y'all. And the only thing I want y'all to do is like and subscribe. That's it. I'll literally get up every damn day to do what y'all want me to do. And the only thing I want to do y'all to do for me in return is like and subscribe. That's not too much, right? I'll go do illegal shit on the on the street. I'm doing an illegal U-turn. I might get pulled over. Whatever. Don't care, because it's for y'all. I'll do whatever. Right? Only thing I need y'all to do is like and subscribe. That's it. That's it. Right? So I'm going to Rodeo Drive real quick, y'all. I'm gonna give, I'm gonna let y'all see this in a minute. I'm gonna try to get out if it's not too busy. You know what I mean? So if it's not too busy, I'll let y'all see it. If it is too busy, I'm just going to drive and then I'll just show y'all, you know, a view as far as a car ride, all right? So, I'll get back with y'all in a minute. Okay, y'all. So, unfortunately, I don't think I can find any parking on Rodeo, which is literally the next street over. Rodeo. Right here, I have to make a left. But I'll be able to drive down the strip and show you guys as far as, you know, the stores they got. They got Jimmy Choo. Uh, they got Tiffany. Tiffany's or whatever y'all want to call it, however it's pronounced. Uh, all of these stores that I can't fucking afford. But we'll take a little stroll through Rodeo Drive. See, it's always people out here. All the rich people. They got Fendi. You got Louis Vuitton right there. I can afford a little bit of Louis, though. Don't get it twisted now. Uh, still Louis Vuitton. Van Cleef and or uh, whatever. That's right there. Um, you have a lot of different stores. They got Balenciaga. They got Dolce and Gabbana. They got Dior right there. Another Fendi store. They got Montclair and Balenciaga right here. This is where I bought my shoes at. And this actually is where me and Alexis did our, uh, uh, what do you call it? We did our, uh, our intro here. Chanel store. I think that might be opening up soon. Uh, yeah, man. It's Rodeo. Rodeo collection. Never been inside there. Don't got enough money. They got nice cars like... Uh, see that? What is that? Uh, a Rolls Royce. That might be a Wraith or a Phantom. One of the two. Don't know. Too much money for me to afford, so I'm going to mind my business. They got Hermes. I got a few things from Hermes before. Uh, yeah, this is... And the strip is a little longer. And they have different shops and different little, you know... 
spots where you can go get the stuff that you need that you want you know this is all high-end stuff i guess they will call it christian louboutin right there uh white people asian people a lot of other people that got money not like me because i'm broke but you know yeah this is california this is rodeo on uh what's today y'all it is tuesday this is a tuesday on rodeo right they got pretty women always look at that pretty women always walking out here mm -hmm. yes sir i'll get back with y'all in a minute man i just wanted to give y'all a little okay they got crazy people too yeah hey man no you ain't all right you all right what's wrong diarrhea oh man you're gonna have to find somewhere else to use it oh, you gotta smoke a cigarette <laughs> hey i smoke i smoke my black and mild first before i do no, I'm good. <laughs> no, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Yeah, so it's California. They have a lot of good people. I don't even want to say bad people because I don't believe in bad people. I believe in bad decisions and bad choices, right? So people might be in certain predicaments where they may seem, oh, he's a homeless bum. No, he's not a homeless bum. What he is is a homeless person that might have made bad decisions. That's all I can go with, right? That's how I look at life, that's how I look at things, and that's why I'm always blessed. Uh, I don't know what the hell street I'm on right now, but they got a lot of other uh, stores and stuff like that that I cannot afford. So, I don't know, you know. It's cool, it's, no, it's cool, go do your thing, do your thing, do your thing, G. I ain't gonna hit you. Go ahead. Go ahead. You gonna go? You going? You going? All right. All right. I'm gonna go across this way. <laughs> All right, man. See, it's okay. It's not what you do. It's just how you do it. You know what I mean? California is a very great place to live. It's very expensive. If you cannot afford to live out here, I would not recommend or, well, yeah, recommend anyone to come out here to live unless you have all of your ducks in a row, have all your crosses crossed or your t's crossed and your uh and dot your all of your eyes if not then this is not the the spot for you at the moment it is a dreamland it looks beautiful out here everybody out here is beautiful right for the most part but la comes with the good and the bad you know what i'm saying i just want to keep it real with y'all because i come from some from a place where no, uh, none of this is really possible we don't even look at california like like a real place we look at it like a dreamland you know what i mean being from where we're from and we think that none of this is obtainable but to be honest with y'all all of this shit is attainable only thing you got to do is go out there and get it the only reason i know is because i'm here now i have my own place i have my own car range rover <laughs> but i have my own everything and i'm not rich i'm not far i'm far from rich you know what i mean but i'm here and i'm I'm living the best life that I know how and that I can. So, you know, if I can do that, at least I know the world is bigger than our backyards. The world is bigger than what we know our life to be. You know what I mean? California is not the biggest state in the world. Well, in our in, in the United States, it's one of the biggest other than Texas. But nonetheless, it's just more out here. I'll say that because I haven't been outside of the country yet. And that's my next goal. Is to go outside the country because I haven't been outside the country ever. I don't have a passport. You know what I mean? Although I've been to so many different states and cities within the United States, I've still never been outside the country because I know it's bigger than even California. So when y'all see stuff like this, it's like, okay, yeah, it looks good. It might look different and all of that from where you're from. But guess what? It's in the same area. It's in the same country as you. It's a two, three, four, or a five hour flight from wherever you're from. So don't ever think that this is not obtainable and you can't come here or you're not able to maintain or make it here. You can make it anywhere. You know what I mean? So keep that in mind, y'all. Man, that's just a word. word uh, wise words of the day from T. Vic. You know what I'm saying? This is just a little mini vlog, a little mini tour through Beverly Hills and stuff like that. I'm going to get with y'all in a little bit, all right? On gang, soldier gang.